a little bit rough right now, but it's all good because my package has arrived. This was supposed to come at like eight o'clock, but it's 10 right now. And I just got the notification that it was on my doorstep and we're about to see what it is. There it is. See, not much to say about. Oh, shit. Let me turn off my. <sighs> Big shout to Best Buy for making the transaction smooth and just a breeze. So this is the 64 gig 4K model. Um, really, there's no physical difference between the 64 and 32 gigabytes. It's just really how much you're gonna use it. And I have a feeling I'm gonna be using this heavily considering there's apps and I probably will be putting music and photos and stuff on it. So, do I even have like a, no, I'm gonna rip this off. You get, once you take off the wrapping, a nice little texture right here. Some texture right there, you know, your your typical Apple box, you know, they really put a lot into these boxes. So, yeah, let's get into the product. I think that's what you all are here for. Alright, here's the box. There's the actual Apple TV unit. Here's the remote. I actually have a case on the way for this remote. It honestly looks the same as my last one, but it's way thicker. I had the third gen, which was like thin. Obviously your Apple box, you have your typical paperwork. I think you should have your wires in here somewhere. Your start, your get, your starting guy. Yep, your wires. This right here is the charger for your remote, which I probably won't be using because I have a lot of these lingering around. And then in this box is the power cable. Then back the Apple TV. Do keep in mind you're not getting an HDMI cable in this box. Luckily I have so much HDMI cables lying around. Make sure you have one handy or you buy one separate. So everything right here you see comes in the box. So you get the power cable obviously. You got the remote. You got the streaming device thingy. And you got the cable to charge your remote. So it off. Oh, failed uh all right, there it is. Make sure I grab it before I don't drop it. And then there's another one on the side too for the back. Well, actually there's one that goes all around the device. Oh, to protect the shininess. All right, so yeah, this is how it looks. I don't know if you can tell, but yeah. Here's the back, here's the power cable, square. This is where this goes in, HDMI cable, and Ethernet, if you want to connect it directly to your router, or I'm going to do the physical, I'm going to physically connect this to my uh, network. Pull that off, cable, this one I'm not pulling apart, I'm not going to take the plastic off this one at the moment, because I did put in an order for a case. A nice little sleek silicone case and it's gonna wrap it really nice it's not gonna add too much bulk and it's gonna protect it so got a case on the way for this guy set this up like I said here's my gold tip HDMI cable I have like three of these lying around in my closet and then an Ethernet cable physically connected everything so this is the Ethernet this is the HDMI and then this is the physical cable Put it next to your Apple device or put it next to the Apple TV. And then it's done. All right, so this is how it looks for now. Obviously I have to set it up and then 
once I set it up, I'll let you guys know. Enjoy my well, yeah. This is why. So yeah, this is why I bought it from Best Buy because I get this for a year. Like I said, this is a bedroom TV. Is it right? This is like literally my bedroom. So, and honestly, this is for my bedroom. So there's that. Actually, I'm excited to see the App Store and see what it has to offer.